This thing is pretty rad. Look at this. Mm. Oh, it's on. Like the recording. Yes. Hey, cheers. I don't, I can't. I can't get away from the ice cream. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Hey, Hi. I'm Ashley. I'm Izzy. And I'm Sean. This is Ashley's first Twisty Treat. Me too. Mm -hmm. I've never wow. even heard of it. We, to be totally honest, did not accomplish as much as we wanted to last weekend on the bus. Just didn't have a lot to show you guys. We had a few people reach out and ask us questions, so we figured that we would do a quick Q&A on us, on life, the bus. No Stuff like that. So Izzy's gonna ask us questions, and then we're gonna answer. Yeah. So I'm yeah. Izzy, not Sean. Reoccurring guest. I'm a regular. A favorite reoccurring guest. Oh, crazy thing! I put up a poll on Instagram, and someone sent me back the little like emoji with the. Uh huh. And I don't know if you'll know who this is. It was Alex Wong, professional dancer from So You Think You Can Dance. Whoa. No I used way. to watch this guy on So You Think You Can Dance. What? That's Alex Wong. Holy Schmidt. That's yeah, really Alex Wong. And I mentioned him back and I was like, oh my God, you're Alex Wong. This is so cool. I was like, how did you find my sticker? But this made my day. Ashley, like, you gotta be more calm. Yeah, I, was gonna say, I know. Okay. Like, this is Alex Wong. Alex Wong, is if you're it? watching this, big fans. Didn't know who you were, but like you're very talented. I respect you. <laughs> All right, first one is um, Ashley and I's really good friend Bali. We hey, miss you. Bali. What is each person most excited about about bus life? So, Sean and Ash. I'll go. Okay. You sound it's, confident. It's not really about bus life. I'm excited for the continued build of the bus. Wow. Because I love building the bus. I grew up. And I didn't give a hoot about like tools or building anything. I was all about hockey and sports and you know working out and music. But now I go to Home Depot and I like just geek out. Yeah, I guess I'm just like all into building stuff now. Put a screw in in the bus. Satisfaction. You know, it's yeah, it's so satisfying. It's beautiful. That's cool. It is really cool. So I'm excited to build the bus. Continue building. I'm building a home. You're really building your own wow. home. Some lady at Home Depot. I was buying a bunch of stuff. She's like, "What are you buying this for?" I didn't get into the whole bus thing. I was like, oh, I'm, I'm building my house. I'm building a home. And she's like, wow, not many people your age can do that. That's nice. That's what a lot of people say to us. Oh, I wish I did something like that when I was your age. Now's the time to do it. Yeah. So I'm excited for this like particular vision to come to life. Can't wait to wake up in my bed and look outside that side emergency door window <laughs> and see incredible landscapes and just be surrounded by nature like, everywhere and just kind of like live life however i want to in the time that i want to the way that i want to so you tell me that open up that I'm door like, it's to kind of live with the cycle of the earth i don't know like just allow for time to move me where it needs to be when it just feels right it's just a shift in you and i like we can go wherever we want freedom Excited for the freedom. Camping. Just like I grew up camping. Like, we would go camping every summer. I always loved that feeling of waking up in like a tent and you see like that. I've so. camped in my backyard. Like, I've slept in a tent before. We too. Backyard. Almost not camping. Yeah. Okay. It's kind of scary. We actually like ran three <laughs> extension cords and put a TV in there. It's not camping. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at this wiener dog. It's cute. She's cute. Next question yeah. How will you make money on the road? Great question. <laughs> but seriously, how are we gonna make money on the road? <laughs> I see myself, and this is kinda lame of me, but I see myself like doing sales on the phone, you know, remotely. Mm. It's and nice maybe it's some, a like, reliable some background. It's a, Sean already does this sort of. Yeah. yeah, honestly, it's a skill to be able to sell something on the phone. <laughs> cool thing about it is I think anyone can do it. Like anyone can learn how to do it. With it's not Wi-Fi. We're gonna need an unlimited you guys need plan. Wi -Fi. You guys need Wi -Fi. I need time. One thing I would really like to do is go to school to become an Ayurvedic practitioner and be mm. able to run a practice online. I don't know. Have, the, like, be like a traveling thing that we were talking seriously. about. Seriously. No, like, oh, you guys yeah, have, like, yeah. pop-ups or events wherever you, like, travel. That's a cool idea, honestly. You could... Traveling comedians. <laughs> so you could be a comedian. I don't know. I'm, I'm not, I don't think I'm that type of funny. I think we're situationally... Oh, my God. Like, in front of a stage. I'd probably poop my pants. Question, what's the registration process like? 
I think I kind of know. When you initially purchase the bus, either from a dealer or from Facebook Marketplace, <coughs> or from, or it should be able to come be transferred with a clean title. As far as registration of the bus goes, turning the bus into an RV or a recreational vehicle, it's dependent on your state. All that you have to do is go to your DMV or they call it the tag office in Florida, which is so weird. It makes me think of skin tags. What? Like, I don't know, tag. I also, this may be common knowledge, but you have to have it insured first. Oh my God, yeah. You go to the DMV, They'll pretty much know exactly what you're talking about. Basically, they give you a list of a few different things you can do and say that you have to have like two or three out of, and then someone like goes and inspects It's that it's livable. They pretty much just want to know that you're not using it to like illegally transport goods commercially. What you need is a bed, gas hookup, and running that. water or something, so. Good thing I was Googling folding mattresses today. First song I sing in the shower, like when I want to sing something. This is All I Want for Christmas is You by Mariah Carey. People it always play that too early at Christmas parties. Yeah, it needs to be like the last like, song. Oh my god, like, it's Party. time. <laughs> no, I haven't even drunk a beer yet, and then like, yeah, I got Mariah Carey. How much have you spent on the project, and how does it compare to plan? I mean, the bus was, we paid 5700 I would about say we've spent like about $1,000. Only, you know what? Probably close to 15 Was my cut. What's your goal completion date? I would say... We don't have one. Wednesday? Like tomorrow. I wish. That would be cool. <laughs> then it would be over and you would be bored. Whenever it's done and we have appropriate amount of funds to feel comfortable. Once we're financially ready, then we'll leave. Okay, last um, question. Bag of Bursto. <laughs> okay. Why does Shawnee always wear bucket hats? Is he going through a phase? Just a concerned citizen looking for answers. <laughs> That's Sean's little brother. He's funny. Hey, Darren. Hey, D. That made me laugh. Are you feeling sick? I'm gonna get some alone.